there, Ospreys. Welcome to another Campus Update with Inside Soup. I'm Luis Leon, here to bring you up to date on what's going on this week. If you are an early bird for, decorate, for decorating for the holidays, there are plenty of stores to get affordable and cute decor. One store in particular is getting a lot of buzz for its cute yet inexpensive decorations that will make your dorm, apartment, house, or wherever you live a holiday wonderland. Five Below is a go-to for many college students because of their great deals. They have pillows, ornaments, trees, and separate holiday decor based on themes. All for $5 and below, they even have sweaters and accessories for their furry friends. Our reporter Megan Craig went to the store to check out the hype of the holiday decor. Hey there Ospreys, I'm outside of Five Below looking at the Christmas decorations and they have a lot of unique and cute things to decorate your living area with. Come in and check out the affordable decorations at the Five Below in Town Center. Megan Craig, Inside Swoop. On another note, Monday, November 13th, starts International Education Week. All general events will take place during this week. All events are free and students, faculty and staff are allowed to attend each, each event. The International Center offers many activities and events to help celebrate international education. Some of the events are the UNF Faculty Appreciation and Resource Fair, the Study Abroad Information Session, and the, inform and the International Ospreys Friendsgiving. All events, times, and locations are located on the International Center UNF website. Take a break from the stress of school and homework. This November 16, fans of the Hunger Games saga will be able to gather in theaters to experience the excitement and intrigue of their new film, The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes. The study takes us back to District, to District 12, where we learn about the dark secrets of fun and past. The film promises to be a visual feast with action-packed scenes, unforgettable characters, and a mysterious twist to keep viewers on the edge of their seats. You won't want to miss this, ex this exciting chapter in the Hunger Games saga. So mark your calendars, prepare your bows and arrows, and join us on November 16th for the premiere of the Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes. It will be an epic night that you won't want to miss. For those of you who are looking into the upcoming semester, new technology could always help you stay motivated. Apple's latest edition has just arrived, featuring their brand new M M M3 chip that powers both MacBooks and iMacs. Apple has introduced three versions of this new ship for its MacBooks, M3, M3 Pro, and M3 Max. Additionally, the company surprised us with a new color option, uh, the stylish space black, adding a distinctive touch of style to Apple's already sophisticated computer lineup. The iMac has also undergone a significant upgrade by adopting the M3 ship, boosting its performance significantly from the initial model with the N1. If you are on the lookout for, the com for a computer with a powerful processor, portability, and exceptional quality, we invite you to visit an Apple store where you'll find the best options in computers. The University of North Florida looks to promote areas in, uh, in which the school can give students an outlet outside of the classroom when trying to grow as a person. One of the locations on campus which is beginning to gain a lot of attention is the UNF uh, trails. The trails are great outdoor experience where students have access to come and go on runs through the woods. The, the aesthetic in the trails give people both a connection to nature and increases physical activity. Not only you can go for a run or a simple walk, but you can also do things such as zip lining and canoeing. These activities not only raise a good time, but also give people the ability to get out of the dorms and enjoy the blue skies and warm sun. Everyone knows that being a college student is stressful when you are expected to perform well academically. One of the main factors that can help those struggling is to take advantage of the library and its resources. The library is known to have four floors, however, one of, one of the things that's not promoted is the top two floors. Both the third and fourth floors are leveled to be a noise-free zone and the quiet space and large floors allow students to increase their focus. The floors come with everything ranging from study rooms which are designed to create a perfect space for academic performance along with uh, resources from downstairs. Instead of doing home, homework at home and lacking in concentration, come lock yourself in a space designed to block out all distractions. Well, that's another edition of Inside Soup. Tune in next time for more campus information. I'm Luis Leon, and thanks for joining me on Inside Soup.